What have I done? Screwed it all. Oh, it's really windy. Oh my god, I'm foolish. That's not what it was for. It was just making like a sticker on the screen. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay. So, trying to attract the deer again. They're not. They're not coming around a lot lately. <clears throat> it is extremely windy. And I am so glad to have a day off today. I spend a lot of time driving. Um, sometimes it's downright exhausting. But hey, at least we didn't have to go back to healthcare at work. So, I'm, I'm good with that, man. And I have some online work soon. But I did move the router back out into the living room instead of in the office, because the office in the house is kind of like a closet. There's no windows. And the Wi-Fi range outside was getting horrible. Like, I'd get right here, nothing. And like, it's just right in there by the glass doors but tomorrow's supposed to be a very nice uh, yeah, Mother's Day here in 75 degrees I wasn't going to burn today but I don't think that's a good idea with these kind of winds even though it is much greener look at the trees are coming alive so at least we got that going um, I should be tailing the guard and that's what I need to be doing, but it's too early. It got like 20 the other night. And I don't think anything I planted is coming up yet. Hmm. But it should be much easier. I think I'm going to go more else way. Because then that way, I'll be, uh closer to the hose over there because last year I couldn't even reach the hose like over that way so I'm thinking like here right in this spot and maybe just make it a, a rectangle more long than wide like, like right here maybe we don't got to go massive maybe like right here something like this well, I'm sure the ticks are coming out, so I'm probably going to have to really check. I did get the unfortunate email. My Starlink service is going up. 30 a month. We are no longer in a low capacity area. But it's like, what choice do you have for decent internet out here? My city does run fiber optic cable, but they end it. Right down the road that way. Once you get past up over that hill, I think like the third or fourth hill down that way is where they uh, they end it. So not far, I can like see the line. And our municipality broadband is quite good. But Starlink works, they're constantly launching new satellites, so. It's steadily improved. I mean, hell, it's good enough for live streaming. And I'm still on a Gen 2 satellite, which uh, so far has been extremely reliable. I've had no issue. And I just stuck it up on that pipe. And man, I've been here since July of 22. It'll be two years this summer. Let's see, can I reach into the woods now? I should be able to. I think I got it in a good spot. Let's see how far I can get. It's typically, I used to be able to get like through this forest path. Well, it would, it would get weak a little bit in here, but let's find out. Oh, did the swamp drop? It did, oh no. The swamp's gone. And so are the pond skaters. Well, that's disappointing. Oh, look, here they come. 
This is gonna be huge ferns here in probably like two weeks. These things grow extremely fast. Yeah, they will get quite big. This whole area of the woods is just nothing but ferns and stuff. This forest is very, very bright and alive. I was hoping this is the time of year to find uh, edible mushrooms. But, oh yeah, these lilies are still over here though. Uh, are they dying? They're wilting. Yeah, they don't stay long, do they? No. Hmm. Well, might as well use them. At least one. Let's take this piece. Maybe. Oh no, that's gonna pull the whole thing. <laughs> well, now I probably killed it. There we go. Just the one. <gasps> I'll give that to my wife. She'll she'll love that. Since it's almost gone anyway, the leaves are getting brown. Yeah, eventually we're gonna have tons of like pine trees through here. Which is good because the gas company across the street, it's very noisy. You can hear like a constant humming noise. Ah, oh, it's so good to have some time off. It's, a, uh, it's animal crap. Yeah, I'm not seeing any mushrooms. It is nice it's cooler though because the bugs will probably be horrible tomorrow. I got a feeling. I got a feeling they will. Mm -hmm. yeah, unfortunately, this area, you can't really do much with it. So the gas lines, my neighbors back. Oh, one of them. I guess that's right. I got two houses down the road from me. They're hardly ever here. This place is like summer cabins for them. So. It looks like they cut down some trees on their spot. Yeah, look at how green everything's getting. I hope we get more rain. We need it desperately. <laughs> we really do. <laughs> it's uh, It's been quite dry. I'll see dandelions are coming. Good. That's gonna help the bees. Let your dandelions grow. The local honeybees will thank you. And bees are important. Vital. Some bird flying over. Yeah, where are all the animals at? You know, I haven't seen the deer in a while. This area luckily has grown back just fine. We uh, had a fire, and it's weird, I uncovered all this stuff, I don't know what this is, but I think right here used to be like a shed or something, because it, big pile of wood, then you got this metal trussle or something, I don't know what this is, but it, it certainly looks like some kind of structure or... Uncovered when we had the fire. Huh. Yeah, I don't know what it was. Piece of a car? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, dude, uh, previous owner, I don't know what he did here. Maybe he was mad when he couldn't sell the place for what he wanted. I don't know. Oh, we're getting new tires on the Ford, luckily. Like, just to show you how bad these tires are, they are uh, not not so good. The front ones aren't too bad, but the one, uh, the driver's side rear is worn so bad on one part, like it's bald. Like, these are, these are okay up here, sure. I've seen better though. I'm riding on these. They were good tires at back countries. 245 60R18. 
But we got new tires coming. Getting them on soon. This next week. But this here, I mean, bald. Completely bald. That is not looking nice. And we need this. We gotta, we gotta keep our car going well. We're very car dependent. And on this, isn't worn that much? Real bad. That's the rear and passenger. Yeah, mostly that one. Look, there's a pretty good amount of tread on that one. But it's time. We're just going to get it replaced. It's got to be done. Antenna's holding up. I have to get some leaves now. I'm starting to see a few flowers in the field. And the, uh, one of the ferns coming up. Propane, I think we're doing good. We are at... Whoa. That's not good. It's a little blurry, but it's like 65%. Oh my God. We used 15% since we had a fill in February. That's bad. these pine trees. These will be huge eventually. It's going to take a while though. It'll be as tall as these. And that'll be good because that'll block that uh, building across the street. That noisy thing. And the deer like this woods here. They bed down in here. Usually. Good spot here. <clears throat> Just haven't been able to be home as much because we've been working. But I think we got a Ooh, heard a growl. I thought it was. yeah, lots of pine trees forming here too. They're getting big. It'll take them a while, but now we got a good amount of woods right there. Helps block the road. I like it. Gotta get the trees a little thicker. We'll be good. So, it's time to go in. We've surveyed the area. The shed's held up pretty well. Let's check on that. Make note of the shed. The antenna is crooked, but it seems to be picking up the channels I need. You can't get too many out here. We're too far out. And I think this thing has held up amazing. Mr. Cool uh, Mini Split. Very happy with that thing. It works so good. Oh, it's blowing it. Is it leaning? <laughs> well, I, I do have it a little crooked. So, you know, I wonder. This thing would be long enough. See, I don't think it's a square. I could turn it so the door would be like right there. That might work better actually. That might work. Because then it'd be even. And the. Uh, the two ends would hang off here. Then again, I don't know. This thing long enough, right, to reach the width of this thing. I wonder. Hmm. Maybe we could just put it where the door is on this side. Although this hill would be a hole here, would be where the entrance is. That'd be kind of a pain. I would put it facing the road. Like this. 
that would probably work. I might have to try it. Not today when it's so windy. But, but yeah, put it the door so the door's on this side. I'll have to measure for that later. That may fit. Just might fit. Yeah, because this, this is a decent thing. It's it's like a giant tent, but I mean, it works. As long as it's, you know, stuff you gotta, if it's anything fragile or weather weak, weak to moisture and stuff, um, you wanna get some plastic totes or something. I got some and they, they're decent. I've checked things. There's no leaking, nothing's wet. I mean, at one time the wind was so bad it blew them over and nothing got broke. It's like PC parts in here. Mm -hmm. And I did finally find an area where I can get rid of plastics and other recyclables. So that's good. I'll have this cleared out soon. I actually have some space. Here. And then maybe clear out the office a bit more. Then trying to get a car, but yeah, overall it's uh, it's holding up pretty good in here. It's dry, things are fairly protected, and it gives you a little bit of outside storage. I eventually want to build another PC because I think the box is it this one. I got enough parts in here to build a computer. Mm -hmm. Only thing though, it's going to be on the FX chip, which at this point is rather outdated, but it'll probably work, I think. And I do have a 1063 gig, which, yeah, that's pretty low for VRAM, but we'll see. We got our fishing poles. Maybe we could start going fishing. I think that might be fun. We'll do fishing shows. Snowblower, barely had to use it. But yeah, this, it's all just recyclables you know, to get rid of. And that'll free up all that space and this too. So, but I think, yeah, this does look longer than wider. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Like that's the width here, that's the back door. That's the front door from there. To there. Mm. But then you have the the length, which is there to there. So to me that looks longer. So I'm thinking turn this around. The braces for it would work better. And right now I actually have it crooked too because it's all the braces are in the ground except for right there. <coughs> but I think that might work. That's our that's the width. That's the length of that. We'll have to see. Another project, maybe maybe tomorrow. Maybe, I don't know. Is it is it becoming fall or something? What's going on? Wind sure is picking up. Hmm. I think flowers are coming up. These come up every year. We don't have to do anything. They just do them so themselves. They should be coming up soon. Here they are. Oh, there's some of the white ones already. They're starting to come up. Yeah. So we get these really big ones soon. Purple ones. Yeah, right in here. All these dead things here are gonna come back soon. Just be filled. The yeah, plant life is really something around here. Mm -hmm. Might do some grilling out tomorrow, let's we'll see. That would be nice. We'll see what happens. 
Okay, but I think I'm gonna get inside. So thanks everyone for stopping by. Here we are, early spring. May 11th. Yeah, Mother's Day weekend. Happy Mother's Day.